Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori. And I'm starting a vlog a little early. I'm on my lunch break. But I went and checked my mail and I wanted to share something with you. Um, I was sent this purse by Manu... Manu? Manoy? 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 Them. Link in the bio. And the description box below. Um, not a... I mean, they're sponsoring this video because they sent me this purse. But as always, the opinions are my own. So, you get a thank you. I have had another one of their bags and I love it. Dear member, thank you so much for your order. We really appreciate it. About the leather, how it's manufactured, and look how they come. So, ooh, I got two bags in here. So, you get the box, and then it comes in this luxurious. It's like almost like a fake velvet um, bag. Dust cover, if you will. <gasps> oh, I chose this color coffee guys I know I know it's me I can't help it um this is one of the new bags there's a name for it I will put it up here because I can't remember um unless it's inside softest leather you will ever touch let me tell you that you get the strap that comes with it it's a cross body bag but it is adjustable look at these awesome clips right um adjustable for the bag you also get this which i like this detail it's a key fob you slip your keys on here or anything really your wallet your coin purse whatever and it's on elastic so it's not going anywhere um a little thingy nice and roomy on the inside i like this size it definitely will hold my cell phone it will hold my wallet i mean every little detail even this little snap is magnet and the feel of this leather is like butter so you get your inside which also has a double zip so if you're traveling like i will be a traveling this year um, you have your double zipper, but what you have is this extra bit of security because that snap opens, you slide the loop inside the snap. Now it's not going to keep a criminal out, but it's going to give you this little bit of added security, right? So if somebody tries to get into your purse, when you're, if you're not paying attention, they're going to really have to work at it. And that to me is worth it. Um, Especially because I'm going to Italy next summer and this may be my crossbody bag for it. You have a pocket in the back that again, cell phone will definitely fit down in here if you're out videoing or something. Um, passport, money, anything you need quick access to. Then on the front, you have this again, magnet snap, this portion opens and it looks like it's a flap, but again, it's the double zipper with the safety feature on it, which I love. And it's your outside wallet. Again, the little air dry thingy. So hold some money in here, credit cards, ID, change, lots, oh, there's two of them. Lots of room in here for all of your money and quick essentials. So quick grabbing, but again, it has this safety feature where the zipper pull unsnaps and connects the loop. I think that is fantastic. And then this also snaps down. So you've got many layers to this purse before somebody's getting into it. For travel that's been a concern of mine lately because i've been planning for some trips like this summer i'm going to ireland i don't want to have to worry now they did send me this this is something you would normally order separately but they did send this to me and it's a one of the fabric it's a um camera bag strap but it also has the same detail in these lobster clips to go on your purse. Oh, I love it. It comes with this little 
Uh, keep these. This is great for cable ties. For your chargers, if you're traveling, put them in your purse, your earbuds. Don't lose that. But this is also adjustable, right? So you can make it longer, shorter. We'll make it longer because I already know I'm going to wear this as a crossbody. I will show you the other detail that I love about this bag is if I don't know if these, yeah, these are. Okay. So the straps, they're on a swivel right so it's pretty much as long as you get your strap right you're good to go on this we're gonna go this way oh and i didn't show you the best thing too this little adornment that comes on all of their bags if you don't like it you can absolutely take it off use it as a keychain you can also untie it hang some charms on there make it your own so it doesn't matter i guess if this is in the right position because because they're on the swivel right oh, i love it i will probably go a little longer i have a long torso we've talked about this so i need longer purses guys this is it this is perfect it holds everything you need i love i love this strap i would definitely say order the separate strap oh let me fix it yeah it's definitely gonna hold a lot so what i'm gonna do before i go shopping this weekend because i have a lot of errands to run and i will take you with me of course but i will fill my new purse with all of my purse stuff my monies i'm gonna use ooh, i'm gonna use this front compartment for my like a wallet although i do typically carry a separate wallet so we'll see how how I feel about that. I mean, there's plenty of room on the inside, to be honest with you, for my phone, a wallet, my chapstick, all the things. So we're gonna fill this up this weekend before we go out and run our errands. Um, if you like the looks of this bag or you wanna check them out, I encourage you to click the link in my description box. There will be a coupon down there as well, so you too can order yourself a fun new purse and it they come in lots of different colors i just like the chocolate brown or coffee all right guys that is everything i have for you right now my hair is drying i'm working at my part-time job tonight i will store oh there's another one of those velcro things i will store this in the box and then when i'm not using this purse it will go into its dust bag yeah, I'm super excited. I love that color. I think it'll be fun. All right, let's get to work. I will talk with you later. Bye. Hey, Mooney. Hey, you stay over here. Yeah. We're out front. We're planting, guys. We're planting, and Luna's outside. I extended her little leash, put her harness on her so that she can walk around in the front there for a little bit while we get these plants done. Good morning, everybody. I'm out for a walk with Luna. We're gonna go to the farm stand. Right, Luna? Come on. This is uh, the front side of my condos, just like a community area. Walkway up to the main road. Ah, it's been a very, oh, sorry, I've got, you on her hand. It's been a very productive weekend. I planted some things. Oh, she's going to go potty now. I've planted a few things. Well, actually, I planted a lot. I'll show you. I took a bunch of cuttings and I have some plants that produce some babies. And so what I did is I um, put, oh, sorry. Luna's done. I put them in my in some little pots and I'm gonna bring them to work and share them. Some of my um, colleagues, excuse me, would like to have some cuttings. Yeah, I love it. This is the field, just an open field behind our community down there. And then you kind of get up into civilization. It's civilization. I'm just being facetious, but I will, as soon as we get up here, we're sniffing a lot of stuff along the way. Come on, sweetie. Come on. 
There's all kinds of new smells. Cars up here. Come on. All right, I'll show you when we get up here. We're really taking our time. All right. We're here in the parking lot. Come on. And right over here, this will be set up all summer long. We have our farm stand and they get all kinds of regional, seasonal produce, sometimes some canned goods or home canned like in jars, pickles, jellies, jam, stuff like that. And then they import some stuff. So I'm excited. I need some vegetables to put on the grill. All right, I'm back. I got some beautiful fresh strawberries. I cleaned them, rinsed them. Those are ready to go. I got some chives. I need to clean these up. Some hearty zucchini. These are pretty big, but I'm going to grill them today. Like chop them up and grill them. And then a Vidalia onion because it is the season for Vidalia onions. So I need to finish cleaning up all my produce and then put it away. So that was our haul from the uh, uh, farm stand. So exciting. Hey guys, there's my chicken that I grilled up. Chicken thighs and the zucchini. I already took a bite. It's so good. Mm. I love grilled zucchini. I just put olive oil, salt, and pepper on it. And then the chicken thighs, I marinated for two days while they were defrosting in some Italian dressing. Throw them on the grill. This will be lunch for the next few days. Ooh. And what do you have to say, Looney Tunes? Yeah, you want some chicken. I know, circus dog. Uh, I know. Be careful. All right, okay. guys. I did some repotting. Here's some of my plants. Um, I did put these three type succulents in here and then these are all cuttings. These are some spider plants, some succulents. These, um, there is a pothos back here. These are coleus, all cuttings. I'm going to take to work and give them to my, um, employees or staff or colleagues, whoever wants them. They ask for them. Um, then I'll take you around the corner. That's my patio. There's my beautiful monstera. I love this plant. I do need to do a little rotation. Pretty soon she's going to need a new pot. And here's a couple of my spider plants. And oh, I just stepped on something in this room here. But and then oh, a dragon something. I don't love that plant, but. There is my beautiful Monstera. Now we're gonna look at the other All plant. right, here I have my snake plants or mother-in-law's tongue. That is a something Brazil, I can't remember. Some of these I don't even know. My newest, oh, I made that planter in pottery class. I haven't used it yet. These are my two newest acquisitions. This is, yeah, I don't remember what they're called pink dots or something. Neither one are poisonous. Um, that's where I took a couple of the babies from. My wandering dude. My wandering dude, Devers Dye, my baby. That's a friendship plant. This is a small or a miniature Monstera. It's got some dry patches. I'm trying to see if it needs a bigger pot, a pothos, and then I have some up here. That's my stained glass, and that one needs some attention, so we just ignore it. So that's all my indoor plants, and he's so cute. I'm sleeping in his window. 